professor Brice Saint-Saint. Uh, I come from Benin uh, and I was trained in the field of agriculture and forestry. I did uh, my engineer degree in Benin uh, and uh, my PhD in Belgium, in the Free University of uh, Brussels, uh, in the field of uh, natural resource uh, conservation. And since uh, one year and three months, uh, I'm the rector of the University of uh, Abu Mekanabi in Benin. I'm here to, uh, you know, to, to help the group uh, working uh, on water uh, resource management uh, and to show uh, how this water management issue is a concern of uh, all the university, and particularly a concern of uh, uh, the governing board of uh, the university. That's why I come with uh, our delegation. Uh, uh, for this, uh, all these meetings in different uh, institutions in the Netherlands. Yeah, uh, you know, uh, in Benin we, we have uh, some uh, our experts uh, uh, distributed uh, in uh, different faculties. We have uh, some colleagues uh, on water management uh, in agriculture uh, faculty. We have them uh, in uh, the uh, Polytechnic uh, uh, College. Uh, of uh, our university, and we have some uh, in the Faculty of Science and, and Techniques. Um, the uh, uh, goal is uh, how issue is uh, how we can uh, uh, merge all of these uh, uh, different labs uh, in a kind of uh, national uh, uh, water uh, institution, but also with some linkage with uh, the application. I mean, uh, the Ministry, for example, of uh, Hydrology and, and Water uh, Resource, and also the different uh, NGO working on the field directly to how to manage uh, in a best way uh, water, for example. So how uh, can be the future, uh, how can we sharp this uh, national institute and to, make, uh, to meet this goal? The best uh, way to do is to come and see those who have uh, a very, very long uh, experience uh, on water management, and I think in the world, uh, the Netherlands uh, have the best in institution. That's why, uh, really, we are trying to get uh, this cooperation in order to have uh, a good uh, experience, a good starting point before moving to this uh, uh, establishment of uh, uh, national uh, institute of water. <laughs> we in a coastal uh, country, and uh, in the in most of the coastal countries in West Africa, particularly, uh, we have uh, about 60% uh, of uh, the population, sometimes more than that, uh, living uh, in this uh, coastal area where you have uh, a big problem of uh, uh, inundation, a big uh, problem of uh, uh, water management with uh, this high uh, population density, uh, meaning uh, water pollution uh, and uh, also how to distribute uh, uh, water uh, and uh, in case of, for example, of, of, of uh, you know, inundation, uh, how can really uh, you establish an emergency plan uh, and so on? So there is a, a very very big issue. But if you go now in the uh, inside the, the countries, uh, water management uh, is basically how to make water available uh, in uh, quantity, but also in uh, good uh, uh, quality. And in the northern part, uh, then uh, it is the semi-arid, uh, semi-humid semi zone, and climate change, and now uh, water scarcity is another challenge. Uh, and as far as agriculture is concerned, we are now uh, doing uh, rain-fed agriculture. So how can we manage water in order to have uh, much more, uh, uh, let's say, agricultural period uh, in, in a year? So is this, uh, all these are uh, water management issues we are meeting in Benin. <laughs> the experience uh, in water management uh, uh, that uh, the Dutch partner uh, have uh, is a, a very important uh, uh, pillar for us uh, in order to contribute to the establishment of uh, this uh, national water uh, institution. So what is very important is that, uh, uh, you know, 
Uh, collaboration is not uh, uh, only on technical level, it is also on a human relationship. Uh, and uh, most of us also who are now involved in this uh, project, we know, we know each other uh, through another uh, past uh, project. So we, we, we have to build on uh, what was uh, already uh, established uh, in the frame uh, uh, of uh, uh, relationship, uh, but also more and more knowledge we have uh, uh, of uh, uh, each uh, on each other. Uh, that's why uh, I'm sure that uh, this uh, uh, capacity that can be built here can make a very, very big change in, uh, in Berlin, uh, not only at university level, but uh, with impact on the civil society also. Uh, so for us uh, uh, coming uh, through the, to, to this uh, uh, project, uh, that uh, we hope it will be managed in a participatory uh, way, uh, can uh, really uh, strengthen uh, our motivation to establish uh, this uh, National Institute of Order.